Oh, that's a nice book you have there. Do you know, I, I didn't even wear I thought it was a cufflink, and <laughs> it's my book. Isn't that wild? You are a humble comedy legend. Yeah. You, how did you decide what to put in that book? Because you, there's got to be a million stories that you have. I think what you do awesome. is you, if you write a memoir, you start trying to figure out what you would talk about, what you don't want to talk about, and then as you write it, you kind of go... Uh, you got to be very honest because if you're not, you might you don't do it, don't write it. One of my favorite things about that book, though, is in it you have the nine categories. The that nine you talk categories, about. yes. And these are these are uh, questions that you ask yourself or things that you grade yourself on. No, no. Like what it was correct. is when I was in my I, when I maybe you, know, you I, should tell me what it is. You no, know, no. I want to hear from you. <laughs> Who are you, by the way? I don't. Even I know, know you don't know. No, when I was like I started acting when I was 22, and then, you know. Like 26, and you're, you're an actor in your 20s, and you suddenly go through these phases of not working. And two months, two and a half months, and during that time you think, okay, well, they're on to me. I'll never work again. And then, then you do, and then it's you know New Year's Eve, and you think, gee, I wish I'd used those two months in May and June more effectively than just sitting by the phone. So I, then I hadn't been out of university that long, and I thought, well, maybe... This is all like uh, university. So you have nine categories. You have nine subjects at university. Right. If one of them is career, and you're getting a D mm -hmm. or an E, you can shore up your GPA if you do well in the other uh, subjects. So I divided my uh, life into nine quote-unquote subjects. Gotcha. One was self. Mm -hmm. One was your wife and kids or your girlfriend or whatever that is. Uh, two, three was your original family, siblings and parents. Four was friends. Five, money. Got to have money. Six, career. Seven, creativity. Eight, discipline. Nine, are you getting out? Are you having fun? Lifestyle. Can we grade you on those categories right now? Yes, sir. Or can yeah. you grade yourself on those uh -huh. categories? Let's start with self. Um, you know, the weight's good. Been to the dentist. <laughs> had the cleaning. I'm going to give myself an A. All right, fantastic. What about immediate family? The kids are great. Uh, I would I give myself uh, uh, an A. Excellent. So far, 4.0. Well, I like it. I'm giving it, and I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm very lenient. <laughs> very Let's, lenient. What about friends? Uh, friends. We skip siblings, huh? You don't like your brothers and sisters? I do love my brothers and sisters. I love my siblings. I'm giving myself an A-plus with siblings. Great. Friends, <laughs> stupid idiots. I'm giving it a D. Oh, like they know oh. what they're talking about. <laughs> they judge me. Yeah, go ahead. Five. Um, How's the money situation? Oh, if you don't mind me asking. Uh, it, it's, it's just fine. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Well, you should also buy his book. I mean. Oh uh, yeah. If it, it will could. even be better. <laughs> It'll be go from A to A plus plus. Uh, and um, yeah, what, what else? I think the career is probably. I mean, you, you know, just did Mars. You know That's what? The, you know what? You know, you know what will. Oh, I did Bill Maher. That's very good. But you know what it will say in my gravestone? One word. Almost. <laughs> uh, creativity, you know, kind of. Discipline, bad. Bad. Bad? Yeah. What are you talking Why? I should do the elliptical more. I should, you know, well, work out more. There's always something else to do. You know, do, my arms are under the suit. Are like, it's like a buggy whip. <laughs> with, with material. Just like a wet noodle. A wet noodle <laughs> with material on it. And lifestyle, lifestyle, while I'm talking with you, aren't I? Isn't that great? Yeah. And uh, I did notice that one of, in a recent interview, you said that your specialty are people who play morons with power. Yeah, it is. Yeah. My, it's one of my gifts that's kept me out of the big money. Have Back you thought about category. running for office? No, but Jiminy Glick, you know, I, everyone always thinks Jiminy Glick is, is a guy who was only about me getting back in interviews. Not remotely. He was a moron with power. So he could be a member of Congress. I represent my area, and I knew what I'm talking about. Now, that's the film I want to see. Glick like as a congressman. That would be fantastic. Please, would be good? Will you please do that? All right. All right. If you say so. I do. Well, I must say you're fantastic. Thank you for coming on the show tonight. Hey, my honor. Uh, the humble legend, Mr. Martin Short. Thank you so much.